What's up adventurers, motorcyclists, and everyone in between? This is Moto Camp Adventure. Uh, today I'm going to be doing a restoration or color restoration on a tank bag. So this is a tank bag. It's a nice Tortec tank bag I got on my used F650GS. You can see it's quite discolored, very faded from the sun. When I expand it, you can see how black it actually used to be. And it's in really good condition still. Um, just wanted to really restore the color to it. So I'll be using this uh, Duplicolor vinyl and fabric coating. I sprayed a little area just to see how well it actually colored it. And it didn't really color it too well, but I think after a few coats it might work. So spoiler alert, if you're watching this video, it probably worked. <laughs> Otherwise I wouldn't really post it because I don't want to post stuff that, you know, sends misinformation. One thing you'll really want to do before you start spraying the bag is make sure to clean it with something like Simple Green. Something that doesn't leave residue but is a de degreaser. You use something like a toothbrush as a brush to just scrub out all the stuff you can. And I would suggest just completely soaking it, submerging it in water, cleaning it, getting all of the dirt out, and letting it dry for like a good 24, 48 hours. I actually just set my bag in front of a dehumidifier. So I'm not going to show myself actually spraying it right now because I don't really want to get any overspray on the lens of the camera. I'm sure you can appreciate that. Basically, you just spray this like a normal spray paint, you know, 6 to 12 inches away. Just do a thin coating, let it dry out, and do a few coats. So let's see how this turns out. So I just sprayed two coats on this. I'm letting it dry. While it dries, in the meantime, I'll tell you why I didn't use a dye. I thought maybe a black dye on this might run if it starts raining. I don't really want runny black dye over a red motorcycle. Um, so I figured I would spray this, put some maybe waterproof spray on it for rain protection and see how that works. So this is the tank bag after about, I would say, six coats of that uh, Duplicolor paint. And uh, I'm gonna apply my second coat of Kiwi Camp Dry Heavy Duty Water Repellent. Uh, I hear this gets good reviews on Amazon. I'm gonna try it out. I think I got this at Walmart actually for like six bucks, seven bucks. So here we go. Now I'm really laying this on there thick, but I'm gonna let it dry for about maybe a day and a half, two days. It says do 24 to 48 hours for a dry time, so we'll see how that turns out. Okay, so that's how it's looking now. It's certainly not perfect, but a lot darker than it was before. You can still see some spots like uh, right here that are just didn't darken up for whatever reason. Maybe they just had a little grease and uh, the paint didn't stick or whatever. But for the most part, it looks pretty good. Um, it is raining. I'm trying to test the waterproofness of this, but Honestly, it's not raining hard enough. Um, I don't know how well that waterproofing stuff is going to work, especially uh, when the contents of what's inside here aren't really going to be totally waterproof if this isn't working. This zipper, for whatever reason, this one doesn't work, like, at all. And then this one, just like, it, it just gets to this certain point where it just doesn't want to zip all the way. So, we'll see how that works out. Uh, but for the most part, I'll probably update how well this holds up and uh, let you guys know. So yeah, it looks pretty good on the bike though. I certainly like the look of it. Awesome. If you like the video, please click the like button and consider subscribing for more gear mods, gear reviews, and adventures.